Um, a lot of times people think, well, I don't own my home. I have a loan on it. That's not true. Uh, once you purchase a home with a loan, you own that home. You are on the title. You are the owner of it. Uh, what is the difference between if I'm a W-2 employee or a 1099 employee? So a W-2 employee means that you are full salaried or hourly, or you're, but you're definitely paid by another corporation. Someone who's 1099 is going to always be considered self-employed. Now, some companies where you are an actual employee will still pay their employees through a 1099, but that means that you are still technically self-employed when you file your income taxes. So someone who's 1099 needs to have been in that position for at least two years for us to be able to utilize that income. Uh, if you've only been a 1099 employee for one year, there are certain instances where if you're in the same industry and your company just switched the way that you're paid, that's allowable. But if you go from W-2 to 1099 and you don't have at least two years and you're not in the same industry or with the same company, then you have to wait until you file two years worth of taxes. Got it. And what happens at closing? What happens at closing? Um, all the good stuff. All Happy the day. fun stuff. <laughs> yes, all the fun stuff. Um, you do have to bring a large amount of money in most instances, but that's okay because you've been prepared for that. Uh, you will go to the title company. Um, Courtney will typically be there. Sometimes I'll be there, depending on what my schedule is. I always like to be in my closings if I can, because I love to see my buyers' happy faces. Um, but you will sign all of your loan documents. You will sign all of the title documents. The title documents are what officially make you the owner of a home. Um, a lot of times people think, well, I don't own my home. I have a loan on it. That's not true. Uh, once you purchase a home with a loan, you own that home. You are on the title. You are the owner of it. You'll sign all of those documents. Uh, your title rep will go over all of that information. Good title reps will answer any and all questions. If your loan officer isn't there, I always tell my buyers, call me if you have any questions when we're going over the loan docs. You'll hand over that big check and then you'll get the keys to your new home. So like I said, that's why it's the exciting part. The, the best day of the whole process. It is <laughs> for all of us, for all of us, trust me. <laughs> oh, well, Jackie, thank you so much for the fabulous information. That wraps up our Mortgage Minute with Courtney Williams and Jackie Sager. And if you would like to know more about Rocket Mortgage and you would like to start your home buying journey today, click the link below. And we'll see you on the next episode.